I'm Lumbi Malambo. I'm the president and CEO of JP Dondolo. I don't know how you guys are living out there, but um, one thing I know for sure is that uh, the coronavirus pandemic is changing our lives. People are in need of the things that we underestimate, the basic things. And to me, uh, this uh, COVID-19 has made me realize where our focus should be. More than anything, it's made me appreciate what we here at JP Dondolo do with the water. Um, because now that we're in this situation, I find that water is the key. Everybody needs water. You need water to wash, you need to drink water. Everything centers around water. We are living in this situation where we're learning to live together. We're learning to love one another. We're learning to unite and be strong together. And um, that's a good thing. I feel like it's changing our lives for the better. And if we want to get out of this pandemic, we have to do our part. Hello, my name is Tendai Mushambi. I serve as treasurer on the board of directors for the JB Dondolo organization. Prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, my job required me to travel 50% of the time. Over the last five weeks, I've been able to work from home due to the closing of borders and shelter in place or lockdown orders that are also uh, in place. This has given me more time with my family. Every evening, we've been able to spend time enjoying the beauty of the nature in our community here in the Houston area. We've gone bike riding, walking, and even on the occasional car ride. At all times, we've maintained the adequate distance uh, socially, and we've taken every precaution necessary. In addition, my wife and children have been sewing masks to date, they have donated over 30 masks to high-risk individuals in our community. Those high-risk individuals include the elderly, retirees on fixed incomes. They've also included people who have recently been laid off or furloughed from their jobs. I've also been able to invest more time in my faith. Doing so has helped me realize that there is a higher authority who is in control of the things that are going on around us and that there is only so much I can control. It also reminds me that this too shall pass and life will continue. I want to make a difference. We want to make a difference as a family, a difference that will last throughout this pandemic and afterwards, something that we'll share with our grandchildren and the generations to come. I hope that you will discover your silver lining in this cloud of the pandemic and that you will find inspiration in it and inspiration to pass on to others right now and after the pandemic. Hi, everybody. My name is Greg Schwem. I am an honorary board member of the J.B. Dondolo Foundation. I am also a stand-up comedian. I've been a stand-up comedian for more than 30 years. And a lot of people have been saying to me, gee, Greg, I bet you're getting a lot of material about this COVID-19 thing. Well... First of all, I don't believe COVID-19 is funny. It has touched all of us in tragic ways. We've lost relatives, friends, loved ones. Some of us have been affected personally by the virus. We've had it. We are getting over it. So I don't want to make jokes about that. However, I also believe that humor can get us through the toughest times. We've seen it before. I've seen it after 9-11, for example. Is COVID-19 funny? No. But... I'm sure you can laugh about an awful lot of things that you've had to do in the past couple of weeks or so. Being quarantined, for example, learning how to cook again. Do you know I had a 10 minute conversation with somebody outside a grocery store today about Lysol? That's funny. I believe that when this is over, we are going to need laughter more than ever, and I cannot wait to provide it. Until then, stay safe, everybody. Things are going to get better.